Hi, I'm Jason Bellamy here in Charlotte, North Carolina. Next, this is the conference that looks into the future, and one of the things that will be part of the future of physical therapy for many years is the Physical Therapy Outcomes Registry. This is a project that has been in development or in conversation for several years and really reached a new milestone. You're going to hear about that today. It's going to be the most comprehensive repository for electronic records for physical therapy outcomes. And so to talk about that, I'm joined with Justin Moore and Heather Smith. So, Justin, give me a sense of where is this project now? Why is this a big milestone that we just reached? Yes, uh, the project is uh, hitting a great milestone with this Tuesday's release of our partnership with Quintiles, an outcome sciences company. This really builds on multiple years of work to develop this priority and really come forward with a registry that can really represent physical therapy practice across the continuum of care. We hit that milestone on Tuesday, which actually now moves us into a pilot stage of um, later this year and into next year, where we'll do a public launch where physical therapists around the country will be able to contribute their data to this registry. So Heather, tell me about the pilot. Where are we with the pilot? Uh, have you identified everybody you need for that pilot? Are you looking for more participants? Where are we with that? We have identified the pilot participants. We're working with identified industry leaders and practices during the pilot phase for the second half of the year. Uh, we would encourage anyone who's interested in participating in the registry as we move towards 2015 to go to the registry webpage and contact us for more information. Okay, so then we get to 2015 and the public launch. Mm -hmm. um, so at that point, who can participate in the registry? All licensed physical therapists will be eligible to participate. It's not limited to membership. It's really to try to get that full spectrum of physical therapy by practice setting, by clinical discipline. And so we're really opening it to the entire profession. So in 2015, when we get to the public launch, is anybody required to participate? And then um, what's the data that's going to be collected as part of the initial output of the registry? So no one is going to be required to participate. However, there will be some benefits to participation. For instance, the registry will be certified as a PQRS registry, and therapists who participate can have their data transmitted to Medicare for the purposes of meeting that program's requirements. In addition, later this year, we'll be making public the core data elements so that therapists can begin to collect that data universally. Okay, great. So you can learn more about the registry at ape.org slash registry. And again, this will be an ongoing uh, pro uh, program that's going to be available for years to come and really be part of the future of physical therapy. To learn more about Next and the things that are happening here, you can see other dispatches at the Next website. That's ape.org slash Next. For Heather and Justin, I'm Jason, and we'll catch you later.